Hello everybody, this is Gamer001, and today I'm going to be showing you Linux on uh, the Nintendo Switch, but actually the main thing I'm showing you is Cody today. Let that load. And as you can see, Cody just loaded up, which is pretty awesome on a Nintendo Switch. Let's see here. And then you click on 9 Anime. I installed 9 Anime as a, you know, a test plugin. And then you just click latest here. Just to show you guys that it works and it's actually fully usable. And let's see here. Just gonna click on some random show here. Uh whatever, sure, why not? Sometimes it can take a second to load. As you can see. And I can just click on the latest episode and it should play. And to prove to you, Nintendo Switch. Fully working uh, Cody. Actually, fully working Ubuntu, actually. It's kind of hard to click some stuff. Here we go. Well, if it wants to work, there we go. <laughs> but there you go. It's playing. As you can hear, there's sound. Uh, Bluetooth works. Alright. Stop that. Stop. Stop. Thank you. But as you can see... Cody fully functional on the Nintendo Switch, and you can even use emulators. You pretty much can use pretty much almost anything that's on Ubuntu, but a lot of it needs to be actually compiled to work on the on an ARM sixty four build. But but uh yeah, we have uh, Ubuntu and Cody working now, and uh, you can use pretty much go on the internet. You can use you know, you can just surf the internet with this thing. This is a full computer now. Um, it works pretty well. There is a little bit slow down sometimes, but that's just in it processing stuff. But I have only had only slight issues. Slight. And mostly has to do with Cody. Because Cody was trying to load up during my boot. Every time I tried to boot into uh, Ubuntu. It tried, it tried to start booting up before Ubuntu, and then every time I tried to go out of it, it would just go to the login screen, and yeah. I didn't know that you could choose what you wanted to load up, and uh, yeah, I fixed that. Well, with other people's help, obviously. But the point is, we have Kodi, usable. You can even watch uh, YouTube from this. The touch is kind of annoying. You want to plug in a keyboard and mouse or get a Bluetooth in keyboard. And, uh, yeah. We have it. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And uh, I'll link the tutorial in the video, in the description. Uh, thanks for watching. And have a nice day.